Well, well, well. What did I tell you in the last episode? I told you we would not come back. Number two. Starting the episode number one. Did we deserve that one? It really depends on if you want to get into the the real meaning of the word deserve. <laughs> we were not the strongest player throughout the game, but we did kill uh, the person who had the most badges, I think, and then beat the person who had the second most badges by default because there were only two people left at the end of the game. So, um, yeah, you know, like in some ways, I do feel like we deserve that one. Three kills is low, but you know me. It's not like I played a game where I was like, oh, I, I'm gonna try to only get three kills and win. It's not the case. Ideally, I would love to... I, I court a playstyle where I would prefer to get all of the kills all of the time. And whenever it doesn't happen, I see it as a failure of character. So this is a... Uh, not amazing, but did we get out? I gotta work on my my flat building. It's like high on the list of relevant skills. Dare you? Dare you? Dare you? They dare? Mod is there? Let's do it. I stopped. Oh, my bad. And I'm glad I did. With the knowledge, though. Might have, been, might have been able to push it just just the slightest bit further. This kind of sucks. No, no, no. no. Hey, what are you doing? Okay. I think for now... Run a, uh, play some foundational Tetris. It's a very simple prospect. It just means, you know, get these lines down to the bottom. Once you get up, yeah, you see that you got a one tile wide. That's okay. Roll that one tile wide. Because your brain has not as of yet made the necessary uh, changes in structure and neurological pathing to allow you to easily, uh, from a muscle memory context, make uh, double wide wells. And you know what? It's okay. It's okay. You gotta take the good with the bad, you know what I mean? Still got two attackers, but to be honest, they're not in that... Okay, now we got three attackers. So yes, I will go. Ah! I apologize, by the way. Would you believe that after uh, 200 years on this platform, there are people who think that uh, in the 9,000th Tetris video, which is what we're on right now, um, I am selling out and have become uh, an adolescent YouTuber because sometimes I make faces. These are the faces that a man makes, sweetheart, when he places a piece in the wrong place. He realizes that he's about to get yeeted by his own idiocy. All right? If you can't handle that, maybe you should go back to watching uh, Ryan's toy review. Because as far as I'm concerned, this is mature content. But for the 5,000th time, YouTube, Google, DeepMind, we do not swear. Don't swear. When was the last time you saw a game show with swearing? Six kills. That's that's a solid performance. We can hang our hat on a six kill performance for now. I mean... You're gonna make me seem like a bad dude here, but... I'm not the bad guy. Um, duh. <laughs> so maybe I have sold out, I don't know. Making references to popular media? That's not like you, NL. You don't make references to popular media. You make references to media that was insanely popular when you were 12. You've changed, man. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Um...
Not afraid. Not afeard. Why'd you spill the beans? Oh, because of this. Because of that right there. That is why and whence the beans were spilt. Okay, this is not the piece I thought it was, but we kind of shoehorned ourselves into that spot. And, uh, I'm not upset. Still only six KOs. This got me slightly surprised. I have noticed that perhaps uh, some of the people originally attacking us have, uh, shall we say, rethought their positions. That's okay. Life is a constant rough copy. Maybe you made a mistake attacking me before. Maybe you'd like to atone for this mistake. Maybe it's too late. No, you're okay, you're okay. Yeah, you gotta go. <laughs> ah! That's the problem. That's where you go randoms and you hope... Hope it's a powerful thing. No! <laughs> we were in there! We honestly just made some terrible plays. Just some terrible plays. That's okay. We're on 90 wins. 90% of the way to 100. But realistically, it's probably more like 95% of the way to 100. Because, I mean... I mean, I've gotten like 50 wins. Or maybe I've gotten like 75 wins in the past month and a half. So we're, we're making good progress. Just keep it going here. That was that was not a good performance, but we did have a great and fortuitous little bout of aggression in the mid game. And you know, I've told you my pattern. You might, uh, or my plan, I should say. Um, you might uh, have forgotten, but I haven't, because I'm recording these, you know, all on the same day, as evidenced by the same shirt. Um, my game plan. 100 wins. And then a sojourn into Tetris 99 Invictus, where we will see if it is realistic. Um, for us to be thinking at some point about possibly getting a dub. If it is, and I assume it is, we're going to try to grind for the dub. I'll stop short of saying, you know, oh, I promise 100% in any circumstance we will get a win. Because, like, yeah, I mean, it should go without saying that's my goal. But, like, you know, sometimes stuff happens. Things get in the way. Sometimes, you know... The, the thing with Invictus... Let's let's start by arguing the opposite, you know? In Tetris 99, you get refreshed. You play against new people. Oh, this is not great. Um, pretty much every single game. It is possible to, like, Q-snipe, for example, but it's not... Uh... Hold on, you're okay. I had to check. But you are indeed okay. At least for the time being. Not optimal. No. Why? If we had been able to get to the long piece, we might have been able to bail out there. Anyway, I got myself too cerebral. Damn dude. What? Why? Why? It's like you blew, you blew yourself up with a frag grenade right next to me in PUBG. I probably did it to him, too. He's probably looking at it like, what? Anyway, what was I saying? In Invictus, you know, it's an aperture that only allows a certain, you know, the top whatever percentage of Tetris 99 players in. And you might be saying, well, a lot of people have won a game in Tetris 99. Yeah, but most of them don't willingly queue for, hey, give me the hardest possible mode of Tetris. You know? Um, most people are like me. They like winning. don't maybe possess the necessary uh, skills required to do it on the regular in Invictus, I'm assuming. So, you know, you're really opening yourself up to the kinds of people who willingly are like, oh yeah, I think I could definitely still win against like the highest level competition. Um, which is admirable, but also very scary. 
so I don't know. We'll, we'll see what happens. I'm optimistic. I mean, again, it's like Dan winning a game of Tetris 99, right? You don't have to be the best Tetris 99 player to win a game of Tetris 99. And I, I don't think Dan would take issue with me saying that, you know? I hope. You just gotta be the best player, like, you know, in that match. And even that is a little bit like, you don't really have to be the best player in the match. But why? Like, why? Some of the things... You know that thing you do? The, the Tom Hanks movie? It's not one of Tom Hanks' more popular movies, which is surprising, because it's... Help. Okay, you're gonna have to work with me on this one. Just let the radio silence waft over you. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. She moves in mysterious ways. You, you know that one? It's another YouTube slapper. That's, I mean, I don't care how you feel about YouTube. Plus, I already know about how you feel about YouTube because this is the internet and everybody uh, dislikes them because of South Park. Um, but, come on. That's a good song. You know what else is a good song? The song I sing uh, oh, every time I misplace a piece, which goes, uh, It's all right, it's all right, it's all right. I probably won't get yeeted. Bad joke. But you know what? I like telling bad jokes because it's the only way you can figure out if you got a good one coming. You know? You gotta... You gotta bomb the truly fly, I've heard, from people that have actually flown in this unique context. Of course, as you know, I am a... At uh, times in my life, I've been a prodigious uh, digital aviator. What am I talking about? I don't know, okay? It's kind of like I got myself in a weird position on this run, and I've only recently gotten myself out. Any of these guys struggling? No. Put me back on KOs. No enemies feeling the burn. He was put me in a KO based situation. That's I'm, I'm setting a little trap for myself. Saying, hey self. If you wanna get out, you gotta get out. I don't know. This is is Tetris video number four? Which is not really that much Tetris, but like. Sometimes the old cerebrum gets a little exhausted. Usually the Tetris playing is the last to go. First the commentary goes, but I've noticed a few more missed drops. Very bad timing on me getting a little spooky there. No, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah! So you must be a fool. It's your only explanation there. You must be an idiot. To be placed in pieces like that. <sighs> so close to the sauce. That, that was a, a game where everything was going fine. You know, it, it's you can never tell early in a Tetris 99 game if you're going to win. Things only crystallize in the top 10 most of the time. You can tell if you're going to lose. But... Um, we were we had a ticket to the lottery. We we had a we bought 10 50 50 tickets. Is it 50 50 raffles? Canadian things? I don't know. It's where you go to uh, a sporting event usually, and they do something called a 50 50 uh, raffle. A 50 50 raffle means I've just repeated myself. I've acknowledged um, here, but um, you know you buy a ticket for 10 bucks. Five bucks goes to the prize. Five bucks. Uh, goes to the organization. You might say, why on earth would I ever? Those are terrible odds. 
Oh, that's worse than the rake at uh, James Bond's Baccarat games. Okay, I didn't realize I was talking to you know, Malcolm Glad Gladwell. What are you doing? Also, it's for charity, so... Stop taking yourself so seriously. It just makes you look weird in this situation. It's a charitable thing. Now you're making it all about... We well, bring it in terms like the rake, as if this is L Las Vegas. You know, this is Pee Wee Kids Hockey. You got a problem, okay? We've been trying to tell you for a long time, but you continue to ignore us. We've told you you're gambling. It's starting to tear this organization apart. Probably be on attackers, huh? Anyway, that's what a 50-50 raffle is. It's a way to... It's a charity lottery. Let me rephrase, because that's not ambiguous. Or sorry, that is ambiguous. It's a lottery setup. Usually done for charity to justify the large amount of uh, rake that the organization takes. I do sort of stand by my original joke hypothesis, though, that if you're complaining about the rake in a casino game for charity, you might need to talk to somebody. That's just my two cents. I'm just looking out for you. Might not seem like I'm looking out for you because it makes you feel uncomfortable, but I assure you, uh, I'm looking out for you by making you uncomfortable in this case. Sometimes it needs to be done, you know? And I hope you would do the same for me. Hey, NL, you, you're building bad. You're putting stuff on top of the garbage. Shut up. Not right now, okay? I mean, like, in the future. Good building. Put me on... Oh, that's the wrong thing to do. Through the merciful act of our Tetris Lord, Alexi, we have been mostly unpenalized. Very surprising. It's okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You've done it. <laughs> Gotten yourself out of the mess. You got a two-tile wide. You're building like a dummy. But that's not unusual. That's, that's in fact, hyper-usual. It's so conventional that the Oscars are considering awarding it Best Picture already. It's just better to build it that way. Yeah, now, thank you. Dude, there, something good's happening here. What it's like ain't exactly clear. Blue pieces are fine, break it down like such. This time blue piece is not fine. Unafraid, modestly afraid. I would like a long piece, please. Normally, in many situations and circumstances, I would not feel compelled to wait. That was not one of those circumstances that seemed like, you know, waiting, albeit the hardest part, also the most critical. You gotta bust open at some point. It's a good time to have a lot of momentum, and we must be badge lord. Which means this is pretty much for all the marbles right here. Okay, that was huge controller haunting. Good. Very nice. Very nice indeed. It'll work. Remember the spectrum? It'll work. That's pretty high on the Tetris spectrum. It's above... Hey, that'll work with a long piece. Okay, we got oranges coming up. Fair enough. Get your orange set up. 
These guys, they're not suffering as much as I would like. No, it sounds like a... In, in any other avenue of life, that would sound like a terrible statement. In Tetris... I mean, really, I guess in any, like, competitive video game context. It makes sense, okay? It doesn't make me a bad person to want my opponents to... I mean, I don't really care if they suffer, but I do want them to perish. If they die painlessly... It might even be better from a game theory standpoint. Because then they'll be more likely to queue up and be destroyed by me later. Oh no, what have I done? That's, that's hubris, radio silence, by the way. Oh. You'll rue the day, sirs. It's beautiful. Little combo. Just a little combo. Not a big combo. I got one more for you. I really thought we were in second there. The two people that were still going there, though, they were in a real good spot. Hello, my son. Would you like to bless this run? Would you like to bless my run? Hello, my boy. Hello. You, why? Oh, he's crazy. He's like, I am not... Frick you, I won't do what you tell me! See, so I was gonna pick him up and put him on the desk. He writhed out of my, uh, out of my grasp, and then jumped on the desk. Luca. He says no. He doesn't want to give me a little, little air kiss right now. That's okay. It's all right. You know what they say is, uh, save the air kisses for after the Tetris match. Doesn't really make any sense. Uh, okay. Everything's fine. I'm telling you, whoever, some YouTuber, because it's always one of us, has done an incredible disservice to the Tetris 99 community. Telling them the way forward in this game is to do this weird early send something but actually it's nothing strat. If you're following this strat, it's not too late to switch to the Church of Northern Lion, okay? I've had my own nonsensical strategies. We've abandoned them in favor of uh, doing the hard work, you know? A conventional approach that might seem uh, old-fashioned, but gets results. Maybe not the best results, mind you, but like... Like, we're, we're trying, okay? I don't see why you gotta be so rude about it. You know, I'm just trying to help. Okay, you wanna... I, I guess we're gonna have an attacker-driven setup. Yeah, just, just knock stuff around, Ruka. I encourage you to do so. Learn, learn what it means to play, you know? We only had one attacker by the time we sent. Because, you know, when you, when you play an attacker-driven ball game, it's a risky endeavor. It doesn't always work out. And that's okay. Hello, Ruka. I was just about to ask, actually, if you wanted to, uh... 
walk in front of the screen. I was feeling like, I, I was like, what's wrong with this run today? And I realized that, um, how are we expo expected to play at a high level when we can actually functionally uh, see what's happening? That's a, a Northern Lion classic right there. This is okay. Put the long piece there. Break it down. Don't have me break this thing down for nothing. I want to see y'all on your baddest behavior. Lend me some sugar. I am your neighbor, etc., etc. Okay, now we got another one tile wide setup. No fear. And the garbage hole is actually in like a pretty solid location. Not sweating. Ooh, that felt good. That Those badges. I want him. I got him. He made me wait, though. It was a comedic timing sort of set, set up there. Oh, another one. I think he cleared him. That's unfortunate. I don't know. Things happen faster. I, honestly, that guy, he's playing the whole... He's putting the system on trial. Ruka, don't knock over the switch. It's in its dock right now. He's, he's becoming sentient. Yeah, a nice first party Nintendo console would be a shame if something happened to it. <laughs> you would. <laughs> You're the one who's out, Gobby. Out of his freaking mind. Please? I mean, it. Just not too upset, but like it would have been nice to get like an orange or a, a line piece at some point along the road there. That's my bad though. This is now a D tier episode, and we got one run to pull it back together. Who's that boy? Fluffy boy. Knocks stuff off of the desk when he doesn't get his way. It's Ruka. He's pretending to sleep, but really, I can see that he's annoyed. Okay. It's Daylight Savings, brother. Take a snooze. Or rather, I guess you already would have taken more snoozing. Look, British Columbia is in, uh, in caucus right now, um, determining whether or not they want to continue Daylight Savings, right? Uh, I think it's an antiquated idea, and me personally, I would support it, um, you know, being discontinued forever. Um, but NL, what about, like, all the farmers? Hey, welcome to politics. Sometimes, you know, I gotta vote for what I want. Instead of what, you know, everybody wants something. That's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, uh, I'm going to bat for me on this issue. This is a numero uno issue. Either way, I will say, falling back, definitely better than springing forward, obviously. However, this year, falling back, you know, when you gain an extra hour, made me feel very old. Very, very, like a, like a wizened sage. Because, you know, it used to be you get an extra hour of sleep. Now, and it's not a bad, it's still a positive, don't get me wrong. But now, instead of gaining an extra hour of sleep, I just wake up at the same time, and the time on the clock is like an hour earlier. Which is still, again, probably don't need me to tell you, it's still like a positive. But, it's not as, it's not as cool now as it used to be. Daylight savings used to be hip, used to be with it, used to be taka 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 taka. No longer. You dare uh, besmirch my power and value by suggesting in any way, shape, or form I'm about to be sent. I honestly, if you're, I feel bad is what I just should say right out of the cut here. Because I think a lot of people are being grifted by the klaxons in the game right now. Not the band. Who I haven't really followed for a long time. Are they still doing okay? 
We got blues coming up. Oh, we got blues coming up. But if you thought I was dead, like my partner, you just threw off the cliff. You've made a classic mistake, so you're done. Give me your badges. What did you do? He made it out. My man, what are you doing? Put me on randos. Deserved. Well, I think that's enough Tetris for today. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. I'll see you next time on the road to 100 victories. See ya!